Hi guys! Today I want to talk a little bit about my reading goal that I set myself for this year because I reached it <laughs> recently. My goal was to read the 42 books that I had on my TBR at the end of 2019, ideally before buying any new books. Full disclosure, I did buy a lot of new books during the first half of this year, but I also read most of them already, so I feel like that's fair enough. But obviously, that part of the goal I didn't actually read. But I did deal with the 42 books on my TBR one way or another. Going back a little bit, I got to 42 books on my TBR because I didn't read for quite a lot of years, during which I still was fascinated with books. I accumulated some through being gifted them, through asking for them, through buying them myself, often in secondhand shops. So I just had a lot of books that I hadn't read on my shelves and I thought that wasn't super cool. It's not something I very much enjoy. And also a lot of books where I just wasn't sure that I even wanted to read them. So I sort of promised myself that I would deal with them. I did read throughout the second half of 2019 after starting to read again. While I did buy a lot of new books, I also read from my shelves. That obviously leads to me reading the ones that I'm most interested in. And then the ones that I wasn't as interested in stayed on my shelves. So I also unhauled a lot of books, which you already saw in my unhaul. So obviously I didn't read all the 42 books. I've read 22 this year so far and a lot of them were ones that I bought new. But I did try with a lot of them. Some of them I DNF'd, some of them I just tried to knew that it wasn't something I wanted to read. So I gave them away. I have some of them still. I have given some of them to friends and family. And fine with that, I never just throw them out. So after dealing with the best books and the worst, well, for me personally, at least, I did have the sort of middle section where I was very unsure. So a lot of them I tried to read and just couldn't get myself to continue. Most of them are just not my genre, which when you try and buy books but you don't know what your tastes are because you don't actually currently read, that's bound to happen, right? So it's okay, obviously. It, you know, I'm not gonna do that again. I'm gonna be very careful with the books I'm gonna buy. And that's the entire reason I did this, because one, I'm going to move and I don't want to bring a hundred books with me, 50 of which I actually don't like and never want to read. <laughs> Because that's just a giant waste of money and space. And I also just like the feeling of having books that I really love on my shelves that I've read. And then just a small pile of books that I can read next. So yeah, I wanted to deal with all these books. I think I did give most of them a fair chance. I can sort of excuse me getting rid of this many books uh, by just promising myself to not do that again and just buy books when I want to read them and then read them and then buy a new book. I currently actually have four books on my TBR, I think. Four, is it four? I can't count, it's three. I have three books on my TBR right now, all of which I bought this year, so obviously the challenge is still fulfilled. I'm quite excited for all of them too which is great, it's a great feeling. Like, let me know if that's something you aspire to, like a small TBR, or if you enjoy having like a hundred unread books on your shelves. If that works for you, you go. Honestly, I would lose my mind, but I'm not judging. That's all for today, and I'll see you soon.